Welcome to another in the continuing series of 4-Minute Fridays from TPM. My name is Bruce Harris and I'm a Senior Applications Engineer here at TPM. Today we're going to be showing you how to show conduit that is located below ground differently than conduit above ground in a Revit MEP view. With that said, let's go to Revit and get started. Now we're over here in Revit and I have a panel board here and you can see there's three conduit runs that are running down from the bottom of that conduit. And we also have some conduit here that is above ground, that's above these panels. Now in the view currently I am not seeing anything below the slab. So let's talk a little bit about our view range and how it's going to apply to this situation. So we're going to go over here to our view range and right now both our bottom and our view depth are both set to zero. Now I know I need to go minus four down to see the conduit. So if I were to set both of them to minus four and go OK, I now see my conduit below slab. Now if I do it that way, I'm not ever going to be able to see my conduit below slab differently than the conduit I have above slab. So instead of doing it the way I just did it, we're going to do it a little differently. We're going to go back into our view range and this time we're going to leave the depth at minus four because that's how far below the slab I need to go to see that conduit. But I'm going to also set my bottom back to zero and then go OK. Now initially I see a little bit of line weight change because of that, but let's say that I want to um, actually see a different line type for the conduit below slab than I do for the conduit above slab. Now they don't make that real easy to find but I'm going to go over here to visibility graphics and we're going to go down to something called lines and I know it may make more sense if it was something else but it's called lines and the region between the bottom of your view and the view depth is called beyond and we have the ability right here with beyond to control what beyond is differently than what things are above ground so the only thing I'm going to change is the pattern so I'm going to go in here and change the pattern to uh, say eighth inch dash and go OK and one more OK and now we see the conduit run that is below slab differently than the conduit run above slab. Now once again that is because of our view depth so if I were to go back to what I had before if I were to also change the bottom to minus four then it would no longer have the characteristics of that beyond. So let me go change my view depth back to zero at the bottom. And remember it was in visibility graphics, lines, and beyond. And I'm going to go ahead and change it and make it even a little bit finer than that. So let's make it 330 seconds and go OK and OK and now my line work below the slab, so my conduit in this case, is displayed differently than my conduit above ground. Thank you for watching another in our continuing series of 4-Minute Fridays from TPM. 
Look for us at tpm.com or you can subscribe to TPM Solutions channel on YouTube. Once again, thank you for watching.